Hey guys, and welcome back to Haunting Grounds. Uh, when we last left off, we were stuck in this alchemy area, and I have been experimenting a little bit with this alchemy system off camera. I'm not a fan, I think it's fair to say. It's kind of interesting. It's essentially a slot machine that allows you to get items, uh, but it's pretty much luck based. I mean, I think each particular set with each medallion is predetermined, so you could try and memorize all of the revolving balls and get what you want, but yeah, I, I don't think there's too many people that are going to be doing that. Um, anyway, I did spend a couple of these off camera. And um, we got some alchemist earrings, which platinum earrings in the shape of an ankh recover from a state of panic much faster than usual. Additionally, you panic to a lesser degree when hit. Uh, I got that out of the machine. I got these out of the machine as well. Uh, four of these. Magna Esca. I don't know what that does. Uh, it doesn't tell me. So, And I got some other things as well. I think, or maybe I didn't, was it that, no, okay, I actually thought I got a few other little bits and pieces from here as well, but I actually don't think I did, so what I'll do, so, <clears throat> let's use one, don't kick the machine woman, right, so medallion, you basically have to try and line these up, but, as you can see, that's way easier said than done. And quite often, you can literally just come out with nothing. So, <clears throat> what I'm probably going to do is do those off camera. Because I get the feeling that we're probably going to need these resources. If the game would actually respond. But, um... Yeah, I kind of suck at it, and I don't really like it, so we're just going to continue for now. Right. So hopefully our dog is surviving safely somewhere. Now, I can't remember where we got to. It's been bloody ages since I've... Oh, we're outside. It has been a little while since I've last played. Oh. Well, that sucks. Ooh. Um, ah, oh shit. And now the dickhead's after us. Can we pick that up? I guess not. Shit. Alright, and I don't know where Pooch has gone. Which is really problematic. Okay, that's not going very well at all, is it? Ooh, let's go through here. Alright, you can piss off, mate. I do not like you. Ooh. Can we go through here? Don't have time for this. Well, that's no good. Oh, man. Where the hell are we going? <laughs> We're just going to keep running. Run to the... Oh, dear. Nope, 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 nope. Definitely don't want to be running into a dead end. Uh, we have flowers and we have... Ooh. Have to get away. You don't have time for this. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Okay. I get the feeling we're going to be running out of stamina pretty soon. Now, where the hell can we hide? I'm trouble. Ooh. Get on it. Get on it. Get on it. Oh, she's so slow. She's so freaking slow, man. And we're starting to panic, which is not great. Now, where does this mystery door go? It's a shame, really, we can't kick him off the edge. But I don't really want to risk that. Ah, uh, shit. Oh, God. Okay, can we hide here somewhere? I guess not. You unlock the door. Great. I like unlocking the doors. Can we go through it? Oh, we're really freaking out now. So this takes us back to the beginning. Which is curious. 
Uh, uh, getting fucked over by the controls. Hey, Hugi, attack, kill. Wait, oof, oof, hiding. Ah, <sighs> Jesus. Oh no 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 no. Oh no 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 no. You can piss off, mate. <laughs> Huey. Huey's just chilling. Wow, he's like moon moonwalking or something. He's like dancing. He's totally chilled out right now. Hugi is oh Oh, it says coast clear, but then it makes a horrible sound, like Huey just got kicked in the face. Um, right, so... Oh, shit! You've got to be fucking kidding me. Seriously? We've literally just got rid of this guy. And he's up our arsehole straight away. Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay. Think, think, think. It's been so long since I've played. Uh, I can't really think of anywhere in particular where we could hide. Can we hide around here? Maybe. Possibly. At least we can have a little bit of a breather. Which is probably a good thing. So when he disappears... Oh no. When he disappears, it's like he doesn't actually go that far away. Oh, piss off. Sounds like he's jerking off or something. It's unfortunate that we can't really... Oh, come on! Really? You fucking asshole. Hopefully we can go hide under the bed again, but I... Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know about that. Look at him! Look at him, he's on it! He's had his fucking red ball, that's for sure. Oh, actually, I know where we might be able to lose this dickhead. Ah, <sighs> oh, this is not great, actually. This is not where I wanted to go. Okay, that's fine. No, don't close the door, you fucking bellend. Right, I don't know what's going on. Sounds like he slipped and fell down the stairs. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so what's problematic is every time we transition to another scene, um, our controls completely reverse and change because our controls are dependent on the way we're looking. Which is not great. Okay. Right, let's save. Let's put down a hard save. So we've escaped for now. I say, optimistically. So we found like loads of new areas to explore. But we've got to like, you know, get to them. Hopefully we can get to them up here. Yeah, he is kind of <clears throat> obnoxious. Like he is not letting us go. Now, I get it, he really wants to play with us, but that's not really our problem, is it? Oh, I hope this twat isn't just going to be around the corner. Okay, we're okay. And I don't know what that sound is. Whatever it is, it's... kind of sounds like it's happening through here, but... Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Ah, oh, fuck. 
That's the trouble. I kind of want to call Huey. Ooh. But the problem with... Oh, no. Why did you do that? What? What was that about? Can we go down the stairs today? Or down the ladder, I should say. Um... We can't actually call Huey because as soon as we do, he instantly knows where we are. This is a problem. Uh, Alright, fine. We're just gonna keep, keep running. Keep running. Keep running. Keep running. Uh, you know what this game needs? It needs a shotgun. A big one. Alright. Okay, so, we're now kind of back, almost, uh, I don't know, do we risk it, do we risk sitting down? We're still being chased, and there's those kinky sounds again, right, this is the door, alright, can we shut that please? Right, circle is supposed to shut doors, but apparently it only shuts doors when the game wants you to shut doors. Right, we've got some lavender, which is cool, I guess. Can we really not shut this door? Right, okay, we can, but we have to be in the actual door hole to shut the door. You have to be by the door, you have to be in the door hole. Tinkering out a few chords may soothe my nerves a bit, but now is hardly the time or place to be practicing my piano skills. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, God, five minutes, man. Five minutes, seriously. I, I don't know what this is gonna do. Oh, no. Yeah, I know, Huey, I know, but there must be something you can do to stop him chasing you, because this is a little bit ridiculous. Like, we're kind of at a roadblock here, where we cannot progress at all. I don't know, what is this? Pick it up and we can find out. Oh, um... Okay, medallion. Sure, I guess. Right, Hughie. Hughie, go. Go. No? Oh, yeah, he's, like, stuck upstairs, isn't he? Ah, that's problematic. Now, where does that... Oh. We can probably get Hughie to go under there. But... What do we have? Um, no. Setting it on the ground. I mean, maybe we've just got to try and blow him up. Yep, that worked. Kind of. Come on, you twat. Come on, you absolute dick. Right, there's two. Yeah, laugh all you want, dipshit. That's it. Right, what else have we got here? Throw at enemies, explodes on impact. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Can we, like, aim at him and kick him? Ooh. That's a nice... Ah, good. Keep at it. Kick him whilst he's trying to run away. Come back, you fat piece of shit. Oh, wait, hang on. Right, okay. So... When he's... running away, I guess there's nothing we can do. <sighs> now, with any luck, by chasing him off like that, we will um, be rid of him for a while. Hopefully. 
Ah, oh, come on, Hughie. Come on. Huey, Hughie, whatever. Like, where is he? Where's the dog? I didn't realise in this game we would have so much trouble um, just keeping the dog with us. I really did think that he... Oh, an onion. What do we do with onions? I really did think that the dog was going to stick with us through like pretty much the whole thing. Ah. Lowers the dog's stamina. Well, that seems pointless. Because it seems to me the biggest challenge is when you don't have the dog, you're defenseless. But the dog is... Oh, God, where are we now? Beef jerky? Cool. The trouble is... We're very... Oh. Oh. Does that mean he's following us again? It's sort of like a... Let's just forget about it. Out of sight, out of mind, or so they say. Yeah, I guess. Whatever keeps you happy. There's no way I'd even consider lying down here. Uh, can we not, like, hide under the bed or anything? Alright, fine. Right. So, that seems to be, like, a little hidey shed. Ooh, can we hide under here, maybe? We actually can. Good to know. Alright. So where does this go to? Ah, there he is. There's the dog. All right. So where are we on the map? <sighs> so we've just linked up basically right here again, which is good. All right. Come on, boy. There we go. Can we? Come on. Come on. Alright, I've kind of forgotten the controls. Unlike how to praise Hughie. Right, can we send him through here? Go. Yes, we can. But what's there? Anything? Go. So what's... What's the point in this? Fresh flowers. Okay. What do fresh flowers do? Oh, it's a key item. These flowers look as if they've literally just been picked out of the ground. They're giving off a sweet nectar-like smell. Ah. Come on. All right. Sure. No. Don't say he's back already. Come on. We've literally only just got rid of him. So I don't think there's anything back there that we can go to. Uh, yeah, so that's literally just his little hidey hole. Okay. Let's go back upstairs. Because there was quite a few... What are you barking at? Kiwi, what are you barking at, boy? Come on. Now's not the time to be making noise and drawing attention to ourselves. It really isn't. Not when fucking Uncle Fester's running around out there. Uncle fucking Fiddler, more like. Right, what's this? Oh. Looks like it pivots at the base. Rotate by pressing right or left on the left analog stick. Okay. Well. It seems to do something. If we shine it out the window. Right, okay. So we'll leave that like that then. 
and we can't do anything else here. So let's creep along. I don't really want to go back outside that way, do we? It has to be more in here, surely. That leads us full circle. I like the way these maps are so interconnected. That's pretty cool. Uh, almost like a Metroidvania kind of feel to it. Almost, but not really. Uh, so whatever we've got to do, it's out here. I guess. So there's that bench that we can run under. Uh, we're completely out of throwable equipment now to escape. Um, Fiddler Festa. Which is problematic. Because it looks like if we defeat him, he stays away for a good long time. However, if... Oh, right, we've got all this down here. Oh, God. What's all this about? There's a breeze coming from the other side. I wonder where it leads. Uh, I don't know, but apparently there's not a lot we can do with that just yet. So... Fertile new grounds. Sit. Sit, boy. All right, let's get Shake. you. Let's get you all loved up. Shake. There we go, boy. There we go. Shake. Good lad. Now, where are we? So we're in this new area here. Not quite a graveyard. That's locked. Locked from the other side. Alright. And there's a hole at the top as well. Ah, hello. Go in there, my boy. Go in. Go, Huey. Huey, can we bless? There's a hole in the wall. I think I can see light on the other side. It must lead somewhere. Yeah, Go, so. Huey, can you, like, come, come here? Come on. Oh, fucking dog. Oi. Right, through. Go, Huey. There we go. Yeah, the dog is a bit of a pain in the ass. It's not too bad, but... Uh... Well, I don't know what he's doing. Go, Huey. Are you doing anything there, buddy? Uh, I think the dog's gone. I don't know where he's gone. I hope he's gone somewhere good. Alright, we've lost the bloody dog now. Which is really not great. Shit. Um, well that's bad. Oh, god damn it. Alright, well, Hugi, you might have... Yeah, well, you know, you've only got yourself to blame. Because you've abandoned me. Oh, I wonder... It didn't make any sound, though. Like, I have no idea what that's done, or what that's accomplished. Although we have discovered that he really doesn't hide very long. And I don't know why the dog is whining. Well... <laughs> yeah, you go Poochie. Although you really are probably just making things a lot worse, I'm just saying. Hey. 
Now what the hell is this gribbly motherfucker doing? Yeah, see? Now he's attacking you. Whoa, dude. That's rough. So does he like eventually piss off or do we just have to watch him running around for the rest of the game? Are we supposed to be able to interact with this? Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, I, I've... Because we can't control Hugi here. Right, whatever. I... Okay. So, I... Guess hiding is pointless? Get him. Get him. Oh, shit. Oh, that's so wrong the way he's there, like, scratching his nuts. That's so wrong. Um, ow, thanks, dude. Let's charge this way. Well, I mean, we got some fresh flowers, so there's that. Oh, that bookshelf. I wonder if I can hide behind it. I remember that bookshelf. Can we, like, shove this bookshelf on him or something? Maybe. <laughs> Where <is you? laughs> Maybe stop gasping. That could be a good idea. Oh, Jesus. Okay, this is bad. This is really bad. Ooh. <laughs> Now, alright, I mean, that kind of worked. Thing is, what she should have done there is taken that opportunity to kick the absolute living fuck out of his head until there was nothing left but a wet, bloody, chunky stump. And then we could have used his eyeballs as earrings. Um, so, he's now in there, which is good, which is fine. But... See, we can put Hughie in that hidey hole. Or Huey. But I don't know what that does. There's some... You say you wonder where that leads, but there's nothing we can do with that. Sit. Right, you sit, B. Sit. You sit, B. And you get some cuddles. Shake. There we go. Shake the paw. Shake. All right, cool. So... What actual special things do we have? We've got the, oh, we've got the two cracked plate keys, but we've already used that, haven't we? Um, so this has been a whole load of not much. I mean, we've still got this here. Come on. Come on. But I don't know what happens if we put him through that hole. Because not much would be... Oh, bloody dog. Come on. Are you... Do you need food? Is that... Is this what this is? Uh, so what have we got here? Right, let's give you some chicken. There you go, buddy. <laughs> Good boy. Right, now. Go through the hole. Go, Huey. Cool. Through the hole. Now, here's the thing. So, do we wait? Because you would have thought, really, that we could have gone through that. But I guess not. Um, okay. Well, I 
guess we're going to be leaving this episode here. Uh, <laughs> I haven't got a fucking clue where we're going, but I will find out for the next time. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what that holds about. I'm also, it's, it's a bit weird when you hide because Huey just attacks the follower and the trouble is the follower is usually kicking the shit out of the dog, uh, which is not really brilliant. And because... Huey was um, kind of barking and being a general distraction and nuisance. I think that was stopping him from actually leaving the area when we were hiding. So again, not really the desired effect. Hmm. I think Huey is be uh, becoming a little bit of a liability. I think the dog needs a little bit more training. What would have been better in this game is when you hid if uh, Huey hid as well because it's kind of odd to say the least but anyway that's just my two cents so when we come back guys I'll figure out what we're supposed to be doing and we shall continue from there so thank you very much for watching and as always till next time